Good evening, I'm Laura Yamada. Paula O'Connor has the night off. Well, millions of dollars in federal stimulus money is keeping hundreds of Hawaii youth employed this summer. But this program is designed to do more than just provide temporary work. Key ITV 4's Paul Drews has the details of the Summer Youth Employment Program in tonight's Project Economy. Hey, Paul. Hey. Searching for that summer job was made easier by this program that employs nearly a thousand young island workers. Each gets a paycheck and valuable skills to make them more marketable for future jobs. Deep inside Diamond Head, several Hawaii college students have a summer mission with the National Guard. We do emergency communications for the state, so we've been tasking them with things that would be used during an emergency. Uh, for example, satellite communications, uh, emergency tactical video teleconferencing. Right now I'm trying to configure the BGAN terminals, which are satellite uh, terminals that receive internet and phone capabilities. It's not your typical summer job. Instead, it's part of a federal stimulus program that provides $10 million to Hawaii for jobs that give youth work and experience, which can be priceless in this economy. For my field, it's hard to actually try to get your foot into the door. Uh, a lot of people are looking for very experienced um, network, like network administrators. Uh, that was quite difficult for me, considering I have no experience. But hopefully with, with this opportunity, it will help me uh, it'll open up more opportunities. The summer employment isn't just in high tech, but wherever workers are needed with the city, state, and even nonprofit organizations. Temporary workers between the ages of 14 and 23 make a minimum of $8 an hour, but that rate goes up based on education and experience. And by the end of this summer experience, some island youth will have a better idea of where they'd like to work in the future. The program not only benefits younger workers, but also those providing the jobs and places to learn, making this summer mission of the Hawaii National Guard a successful one. We're trying to figure out how to bring some of these individuals back uh, if they uh, want to come back. Uh, but ultimately, of course, we would love them to join the Hawaii National Guard. The Summer Employment Jobs Program ends on September 30th. Laura? All right, thanks, Paul.